<laughs> Obesity is simple. Not complicated. Obesity, calories in, calories out. If obesity is simple, the solution to obesity is also simple. Eat less, exercise more, right? Simple? Yes. Simple? And if you don't do that, you're bad. You're weak. Not very bright. Mama didn't love you best growing up. And so you eat for comfort. You've heard you heard this? Throw that away. That idea that obesity is simple, throw it away. I want to tell you two things. Two things. I first want to talk about your breathing. Okay? Obesity says your weight is too much, use your brain, eat less, exercise more, yes? Your breathing, I want to tell you, you're breathing too much. Breathe less. Hold your breath. Can you control your breathing? For a moment, for a minute, for 15 minutes, for a day, no. A week, no. Permanently, no. Inside of your brain, at the base of the brain, in the brain stem, is the control system for your breathing. Not too much, not too slow. You're going to breathe. You can use your brain all you want. Doesn't fix it. Can't make it too fast, can't make it too slow. Hold your breath, you're going to start breathing. God has implanted in us a control system, so you're going to breathe whatever the control system says. Yes? <laughs> no, no, no. You breathe as you're supposed to breathe. You breathe because you got no choice. That's it. Right? Now, what if I told you the same system, the same kind of system controls your weight and your eating? Wouldn't that make sense? God created us with a breathing system with a very powerful control. Similarly, we have now found in research the system which controls your eating and your weight. And it is not under your intellectual control. Instead of mother liked you best, lack of willpower, you're a glutton, you're weak, you're sad, you eat for comfort, and all those stories you've heard about. Instead, what if I tell you there is an accelerator and a brake in your car and we have found the accelerator hunger and break peptide YY satiety in your body there is an accelerator the car goes faster inside of you there is a hormone in your stomach where did God put our hunger hormone huh. stomach the hunger hormone called ghrelin it's a string of amino acids like insulin you know insulin? Okay. Insulin is a protein hormone released by the pancreas. Ghrelin is a protein hormone released by the stomach. Goes up in the morning for breakfast, goes up for lunch, goes up for dinner. And when you eat, it, and it goes away. And if I give you more of it, if I give a rat more of it, they eat more and get fat. If I cut out the stomach and cut out the nerve... The rat is not hungry and starves. Not only has we found the accelerator, but there is an I'm done, I'm finished, a break, stop eating hormone. You know the break on your car? It stops the car. You're eating, I'm done, I'm full, I'm satisfied. That's the break. We found that. We found the break on your eating, and it is called peptide YY. Where did God put that? At the bottom of the small bowel. So when the food gets and fills up the bowel, it goes in. If I inject you with this protein hormone called peptide YY, hungry, about to eat food, as soon as that goes into the vein, into the brain, no, nope, done. Done. 
So obesity, not simple. It is not calories in, calories out. It is a powerful control system in our body as powerful as the one that controls our breathing. So that if I tell you, like you and your doctor, if I tell you, eat less, exercise more, it's unlikely that you can overwhelm the control system in your body. It's unlikely you can overwhelm the control system in your body. But I can rewire you. I cut the stomach and cut the vagus nerve. And do you remember today? Do you remember the patient? She said, I am not hungry. Do you remember? Yes. How can that be? How can that be? John, are you hungry? Not at all. I paid him to say that, but right? Yeah, you cut. I cut the nerve. So the nerve, bu -bu, I'm not hungry. Then, remember we do a bypass. So the food that he eats gets to the bottom sooner, yes? It's a bypass, a short circuit. And that means that the I'm full hormone goes up tenfold. So I eat a little bite, I'm satisfied, I'm full, I'm done, with a little bit. Yes? Well, I didn't like the way I was eating or the portion or I'm a slow eater, but lately...